Oh, yeah. Lighting good. Lights are on. Check, check, check. Lighting displays, funky lights, neon lights. Basically, I'm like a butterfly and I'm attracted to the light. Cut. Take two. Welcome everyone to the channel. My name is Julian Melly and this, this, this is the Future Space Collective. In today's video, we're taking a look at Article. They are a online furniture company specializing in modern, mid-century, and Scandinavian design. I ordered the Sven Charm Tan Sofa. There's a mouthful. Sven Charm Tan Sofa. The Sven Charm, Sven Charme? Sven, this, this one, this, no, actually, you know. Sven Charme, Sven, Sven Oxford? Shit, which one did I buy now? The Sven Charm, Charme, or Charm, I don't know how you say that. Let's just put it, let's just put an E on it to make it seem more fancy. The Sven Charm Tan 72 inch sofa. I placed that order about a year ago. A year ago, that's right folks, a year ago. I placed that order roughly a year ago. This is my in-depth review of this sofa couch. Let's get started. Okay, so Digging In Article has some great furniture to offer. They're a pretty solid company. I was a little bit uncomfortable at the beginning with buying a couch online, not being able to see it in person, not being able to sit on it, um, but I took a chance anyway, and boy am I glad I did because it all worked out, like many of you are probably doing, looking for reviews, looking for more information on the couch. Um, I did the same. It was really well reviewed and it looked great in photos. The couch is definitely gonna be used in photos. Um, so it was important to have a couch that looked good, felt modern, sexy, and just had an all around nice aesthetic to it. So anyways, I placed my order on article roughly a year ago. Here's my order confirmation. It took about two weeks to get to me. Um, as you can see, I paid extra for the inside assembly, which we'll reach back to that later. No troubles there with the speed of shipping. Everything was straightforward. They kept me updated. I'm happy to say it, it was a pretty solid experience, the e-commerce experience ordering from Article Online. Let's get to the sofa itself, shall we? I went with the 72 inch uh, Charme tan sofa, um, which is the smaller, it's a two and a half seater. They also make it in a three seater and they offer it in a few different materials such as fabric and velvet, Ooh, velvet couch. Um, <laughs> but I ended up going with the leather and they have a whole array of colors as well. In the leather, they have the tan, which I think is the nicest, but the blue also looks really interesting. You don't often see uh, a blue leather couch. So these are the color options in the leather. Um, the one I purchased is obviously the tan color. So it came to me in one solid steady piece so I personally was looking for a bit of a smaller couch to use in my space because my space is designed in a modular fashion where I'm constantly shifting around furniture and stuff uh, to do videos, to do photo shoots, things of that nature. I wanted something small that wasn't gonna get in my way, but something that you know also looked really good. So when I saw this couch, I fell in love. No, when I saw this couch, I thought, hey, here's a great contender. It looks to be well made. I think this couch will last me hopefully a lifetime if it's taken care of well. And that was a part of the reason why I chose to go with the leather finish because in my mind, you can keep the leather finish a lot cleaner. You can wipe it down and it's less susceptible to staining because it's leather. Um, it reflects light, it has more texture, and over time the leather is gonna get more worn down and it's only gonna add and, and look better in my opinion as the couch gains more soul, 
as the couch gains more character over time, right? When I order the couch, they will ask you, do you want us to bring the couch inside your home and assemble it for you? Um, or there's another option to just bring it to your front door um, if you have a condo or what have you. Do not order the inside and assembly on the Sven sofa couch. I made that mistake. I got dinged 170 bucks, as you can see right here, because the sofa comes assembled already. So literally the guys bring it up and they told me, yeah, you, you know, if you order again, don't pay for the assembly on the couch because all it is is screwing in the four legs to the couch. So literally the guys dropped it off and they screwed in the four uh, feet or legs, whatever you want to call them, to the couch. We all had a good laugh about it and they went on their way. If I could go back, I would definitely not pay for that and I would just screw in the legs myself as the couch did come in one full piece. <laughs> However, moving on, um, you know, the couch, it looks awesome. I'm really happy with it. It's really served this purpose. It looks great in the space. You know, if you do spill something on it, yeah, if you have to clean it, you just, you can wipe it down with some soap and water as you're seeing here. And it actually dries pretty quick. So you're seeing a time lapse over about 10 minutes. You can see the water dries, no problem. So cleaning and dry time is pretty good. Um, in terms of my thoughts on the couch, so first and foremost, I gotta say, this is one of the most comfortable couches you will sit on. Not only do I have people tell me how comfortable it is when they do sit on it, oh, this couch looks great, it's comfortable, a whole array of adjectives used to describe the couch. It's got style, it's got flair, it's got a nice color to it, it's super comfortable, and I love the look for it. So yeah, in that department, it definitely gets a win in terms of the comfort, the style. You can get a larger one. I I've had people crash on this couch, even though it's small and no problem. It was actually quite comfortable. I really do love this couch. I'm one year in and it's held up great. The quality is held up. I have nothing but good things to say about the quality and the build of it. You can tell it's well made. You know, and a part of the reason I, I, I chose this couch was because I wanted to use it, not only in my videos, um, but for the space and in my photo shoots and stuff. So whenever I'm doing a photo shoot, I love to use this couch when taking photos. Here's a few photos on screen here. Yeah, so overall, the couch is a buy for me. It is, I mean, approaching the more expensive side, but you get what you pay for. And I love the couch. Um, you know, it looks great in the daytime as well. I've done some many, many shoots with it. Um, under more low-key lighting, low-key lighting style being uh, where most of the frame is, is darker. Um, so here's a few shots of that um, in, sort of a, in sort of a darker, more intimate setting. And um, yeah, you know, I really love this couch. I highly recommend it. So in conclusion, I really hope um, seeing all these different sort of shots of the couch and you know it being used in photographs and under some different lighting conditions and hearing my experience about it helps you guys make an informed decision whether or not this is the couch for you. What color would you get it in? I'm curious, you know, I, I the blue seems really interesting to me. Um, then we got the classic black, the charm tam, and a darker uh, chocolate color. What color are you guys most interested in? Let me know in the comments below. If you found this video helpful, I please ask you to subscribe to the channel, hit that like button. Basically any engagement on the video will help to grow the channel so I can make better and bigger videos, review, explore cooler products, cooler things, cooler stuff. So I think that just about covers it for today's video. If you have any further questions, about the couch, I'm happy to answer them down below. I'm trying to inspire a community here of like-minded individuals who are all kind of interested in the same stuff. Um, so I'm happy, I will respond to the comments. Let me know if you have any further questions or opinions on the couch, or if you have any, want to know about anything else in the space that you see. I'm gonna try to get to making videos on just about everything if I can. So, hit that subscribe button to stay tuned for that. I hope this was informative. I hope you guys enjoy and we will see you in the next one. Wow.